Hey kids, today we're back out here with the tier list maker. Um, we are going to be doing a candy tier list this time. So yeah. Also, my birthday was yesterday, which is kind of cool. I am older now. Right. Let's go into desktop tier lists. Okay. So let's see. What are we going to start with? We're going to start with winter green mints. So winter green mints, lifesaver specifically, are the only kind of mints I will eat because I am, I don't really like, um, spearmint or whatever, mint gum, just winter green, tastes good. I had a three pound bag of mints at some point, somebody gave me that for Christmas. Uh, so I'm putting that in the A tier because it's not quite S tier material, you know? It's, they're great, let me tell you, but they're not S tier. Let's see what's next. Sweet tarts. So, sweet tarts are great. Um, it doesn't even have to specifically be the balls of sweet tarts. Um, please don't put that out of context. But, uh, yeah, any kind of sweet tarts. I got sweet tarts, ropes, bites right in front of me right now. They're great. Original sweet tart candies, the ones with the little pill looking things, those are nice until they completely scratch up your mouth, but honestly that's true for every single candy that looks like that. So I'm putting this in the S tier, actually no, no, A tier 2, points deducted for mouth scratching. Okay, looks like my brother's back. So... Uh, Swedish fish, um, Swedish fish are very, very nice. I would not, I'm gonna just put them in the B tier, because they're not A tier nice. They're cool, but they're more of my third choice. If I'm in a convenience store, then I'm probably not gonna go for the Swedish fish first, you know? But I will go for them second if I can't find shit. So, yeah. Okay, I'm pressing the wrong damn button. Alright, Jolly Ranchers. Jolly Ranchers are cool, but the issue with them is that they're insanely sticky. So, yeah, I don't want to have the goddamn sensation of a sticky piece of candy sticking to my damn molars while I am sucking on it. Because that is unpleasant, that is not fun. Like, at all. Why won't this load? Jeez. Yeah, so that's my beef with Jolly Ranchers. These are honestly gonna go in the B tier with um, Swedish Fish because, again, they're not my first choice when I'm in the convenience store, you know? When I'm with the boys, you know, road trip or whatever, I'm not out here going in the convenience store and then getting Jolly Ranchers. Okay. Um, miscellaneous Jelly Beans. So, these are great until you get to, like, the black ones, because I hate licorice jelly beans, so, yeah. These are, like, my fifth choice, so I'm putting them in the C tier, because they're really just not what I'd get. Just randomly. Again, convenience store, I'm only getting jelly beans if it's last resort. Okay, I'm not very into them. Okay, so next is the big ass rainbow lollipop. We all know these. We all know these. This is this might be a universal experience. It probably isn't. Um these are great until you lick enough of it and then it just starts poking at your mouth. Because it's sharp. You licked it into a sharp position, and now you're paying the damn price. Um, putting that in A tier. Because, yeah, points deducted for fucking stabbing me in the tongue. Okay, next is Smarties. Smarties is great. They're one of my favorite candies. But also, they have the same problem with sweet tarts. 
with the mouth scratching, it's annoying. I want to be able to eat more than one package before my mouth starts dying and stuff like that. But no, I can't apparently. So they're going in the A tier. I wonder if anything's even going to be in the S tier today. Oh, I know. Fun dip. This... Okay. Yeah, okay, so excuse that um, little trip my parents and my brother were on. Um, holy shit. Okay. Anyway, fun dip. Fun dip is, um, colored sugar. It is fucking unhealthy, but it is one of my most favorite candies. If I was on a road trip, then this would be my first choice. Okay? This would be my first choice. On anything. I, I won't be able to eat it. Ah. I won't be able to eat it in the car, but, um, yeah. I won't be able to eat it in the car, but I'm still getting it. I once got, like, a 40-pack of Fun Dip once. Yeah. I said once too much. It was great, but the second time I did it, my parents just literally took it from me. That shit is so unhealthy, but it's great. I love the Cherry Yum Deadly Dip. That's, like, the worst name ever for something, but I like it a lot. <clears throat> okay, um, next is this Russian bear candy. I don't know what it's called, but it's great. Immediate S tier. It's not, like, crazy unhealthy, but it's, it's chocolate, you know? It's chocolate. This would not be my first choice in a grocery store because I don't think it's going to be in a grocery store. Uh... We had to go to a Russian food emporium for this stuff. So, <clears throat> yeah. I love me some Russian bear candy. Very, very cool. But not when I'm nauseous. Okay, Reese's Cup next. Um, I am super not into Reese's Cups. Like, at all. I am very not into it. I'm putting it in the E tier. I know... No, no, F tier. I would never buy this. Except for, like, my friend. You know who you are. You know exactly who you are. I'm very, very sorry for putting Reese's Cups in the in the F tier. But, um... <clears throat> I'm not into them at all. Yeah, uh... This is a... Alright, I'm not editing that out. That was my dad. Excuse me. Um, okay, what's next? What have I done? Oh, Snickers. Snickers is also going in the F tier with Reese's because it is god-awful. I hate this. I would never buy it. I would never purchase this product unless it was for a friend. I despise these with their ever being. I never eat them. I've never eaten them on Halloween. I've tried multiple times. The caramel is not for me. It is disgusting. It is a horrible experience. Unpleasant. No shade to anyone who likes them, though, okay? That, that's valid, but I am not into these at all. M&M's are great. Yeah, there, that was a solid second of awkward silence. Yeah, no. M&M's are great. They are my first choice in the... Actually, around second. They're around my second choice if I can't find anything else in the grocery store. They're great. I like them. You know, they're not too insane... The coloring is fine, etc. Damn, I forgot to include Skittles. Okay, one second. I'll be right back. Okay, I got Skittles. Um, Skittles are great. They're also going in the A tier with M&M's because they are my first choice in the grocery store. But points deducted because I can't eat enough of them. Or er, they scratch up my mouth if I eat too much of them. Which is really, really, really cringe. Okay, what's next? What do I have? Starburst, I think. Yeah, um, Starburst is, Starburst is nice. It's not my first choice, though, so I'm putting it down with the jelly beans. They're great until you need to chew them with your front teeth because you're anxious that they're gonna chip away more of your enamel. Um, yeah, also, eating stale Starbursts is an experience. It's not a bad one. It's not a good one. They're just incredibly hard, so you just gotta, like, suck on them. <laughs> I'm just digging my own grave here, am I not? 
I'm just digging my own grave. Elliot, please don't take that out of context. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Reese's Cups. Is there anything else or am I done? Is that just, are we done here? Yeah, I think we're done. So thank you for coming to my tier list. Um, yeah. This was a great experience to film. Damn. Okay, anyway, thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Uh, bye-bye.